Uranium is the heaviest naturally occurring element on Earth. Uranium is very important for energy. One kilogram of enriched uranium-235 can release approximately the same amount of energy as the burning of 20,000 tons of coal. It is also a good asset for trading and that we are going to discuss today. What is the current price performance? What are the best uranium stocks? And do you want to have radioactive material in your investment portfolio? The current price of uranium is $56 per pound. In the early 2000s, the price of uranium was relatively low, averaging around $10 to $20 per pound. The price started to rise significantly around 2004, reaching a peak in mid-2007. During this period, the price of uranium surged to over $130 per pound. Following the peak, the price experienced a significant decline due to the global financial crisis, dropping to around $40 per pound by late 2008. From 2009 to 2010, the price remained remained relatively stable, fluctuating between $40 and $60 per pound. The Fukushima nuclear disaster in March 2011 had a profound impact on the uranium market. The incident led to a decline in nuclear power generation and a decrease in uranium prices. The price dropped to around $50 per pound in the aftermath of the disaster. Between 2011 and 2016, the price of uranium continued to decline, reaching a low point of approximately $18 per pound in late 2016. From 2017 to 2019, the price experienced a slight recovery, hovering around $20 to $30 per pound. In recent years, the price has been relatively subdued, remaining in the range of $25 to $35 per pound. The majority of uranium is used as fuel in nuclear power plants to generate electricity. It is estimated that about 90 to 95 percent of uranium consumption is dedicated to nuclear power production. In the second place, uranium is used in military and defense, such as the production of nuclear weapons and other military military purposes. But it also has a peaceful usage in medical applications, space exploration, industrial and commercial applications. It can be used as a catalyst in the production of high-strength alloys and in certain specialized applications. The percentage of uranium used in these sectors is relatively small compared to the other categories. The country with the largest export and reserves of uranium is currently Kazakhstan, producing and exporting a total of 46% of the world's uranium and with a production of 22,960. Tons. The other biggest producers of uranium are Australia, Namibia, Canada, Uzbekistan, Niger and Russia. Canadian-based Cameco is the largest uranium mining company as per market cap with $12.8 billion and they also have publicly traded stock with $29.58 price. The second largest uranium mining company is Kazadamprom from Kazakhstan with a market cap of $8 billion and the stock is trading at almost $27. BWX Technologies from the US has $6.38 billion market capitalization and stock trades at almost $70. Next Gen Energy also from Canada is trading at $4.5 per share with a market cap of $2.19 billion. The last in our list is Australia-based Paladin Energy with a market cap of $1.39 billion and the stock price is at 47 cents. If you are interested in investing in commodities, stocks, crypto, indices or bonds, you should definitely try to get copy. You can invest with us just one click starting from one US dollar. Sounds good, right? Simply scan this QR code or check the link in the description below to get started. Fill out the form and then make a video call with a Ducas Copy operator. That's all you need to do to open your Ducas Copy bank account. Your Swiss bank account with Ducas Copy will be ready to use the same day. You can also purchase different commodities using our platform. Now let's Let's focus on the best performing uranium mining companies and their stock prices. Shall we add them to our investment portfolio? Let's take a look. There are not many uranium stocks one can invest really. Uranium will be the metal of choice for a carbon-free baseload energy supply in the world with currently 57 nuclear power plants in construction and 100 additional plant. They all need to be fueled in the near future, but there are no new mines starting production with significant output in the next three to five years. With ISR mining, it is a different method. A top company is Uranium Energy Corporation called UEC with their projects in Texas and Wyoming. When uranium prices stay above the $65 line, we think they will restart maybe already next year their production with their Hobson facility and also afterwards the Irigaray plant. Within two years, the company can produce two to three million pounds uranium per year. And within four years, we see this rising to approximately five to six million pounds uranium per year with nice margins as we expect costs below the $40 per pound uranium. 
Important is that the company has not large investments to do, as all is under care and maintenance. The stock price today is around 3 US dollars 40 cents, with a market cap of 1.3 billion dollars, and we have a first price target of 8.5 US dollars for the stock. Another great mine financier is Queen's Road Capital. They finance through convertible debentures, mining companies, and have a strong uranium portfolio built with ISO Energy and NextGen through their shareholdings and convertible bonds. Queen's Road generates an interest income in the order of 9% per annum plus then convertible profits when switching the bond into stocks. The company pays an annual dividend and we expect 2 Canadian cents per share this year, which leads to a yield of almost 3%. Consolidated Uranium is a global uranium developer with a focus on near-term restart of uranium production in the USA. Their uranium and vanadium assets in the US, Canada, Australia and Argentina are of great quality and we love the fast production restart in the US within the next 2-3 to three years. They have resources and also prepare Tony M and the Naros mine for a fast track for a production decision as the US need 50 million pounds of uranium every year to power their 99 nuclear power plants. In addition, they have strategic alliance with energy fuels with guaranteed access to the White Mesa mill for toll milling. The proposed spin-out of Premier American Uranium will also generate nice value for shareholders. By the way, energy fuels itself is also a great uranium company worth to be invested. Uranium is in a deficit and will stay there as we are missing new supply and demand is rising every year worldwide. It is only a question of time when the uranium price will reach the $100 mark. We think this could happen already in 2025. I'm Jochen Steiger, Swiss Resource Capital AG, in partnership with Dukas Copy TV. Thanks for watching us and bye bye from Switzerland.